Hey everybody, what's up? Shadowlands back today with kind of an interesting commentary. It's inspired by a guy named Jim Jong. I really hope I pronounced that right from the Facebook group. Now he asked this question as a complete troll and I'm going to respond to it entirely seriously. He asked me how do I like my eggs? So I have a full on commentary on how to make eggs because actually it's really interesting that he asked this question because my mom taught me like over the course of a year how to perfect the art of eggs. So it's very interesting that he asked this so I'm going to give you a very, very interesting response. So, first of all, eggs are a form of art, perfected by my mother. She taught me how to cook eggs in a million different ways, from omelets to scrambled to deviled. Personally, I love egg burritos and scrambled eggs, so I'm going to teach you guys how I like to make both of these. When it comes to scrambled, you've got to use pepper. Anything besides pepper ruins the flavor. You need to make sure to add butter when cooking the eggs, and let the butter melt a little before pouring the eggs in to release the butter flavor. If you're going to add salt, do it while you're cooking the eggs as well, not after. That way you can avoid the grainy texture and the salt flavor blends rather than concentrates in one spot. You can get it sort of spread out throughout the flavor of the eggs instead of just having that grainy stuff on the top of it at the end. Uh, pepper, however, needs to go on after cooking and after the eggs have had a little time to cool so that the flavor stays sharp. You don't want to accidentally cook out the flavor of the pepper. Don't forget either, always use fresh cracked, none of that store-bought, you know, pre-ground crap. This style often goes well with hash browns or home fries, tea, and a yogurt. Sausage and biscuits on the side are also an option if you aren't on a diet. Also, how to make burritos. So now I'm going to go over how to make burritos, which is my personal favorite of the two. So if you're going with the burrito, you need either a corn or flour tortilla. Either one works. You should put a dash of pepper throughout the burrito and a fair amount of mild Tabasco if you're using a corn tortilla because the spice is stronger to match the mellow corn, or use Cholula if you want to go with the flour one so the flavor meshes well with the lack of seasoning in the tortilla. It's also a good idea to put in a few potatoes and sausage bits regardless of tortilla type. There should be approximately half egg, half everything else, and if you're using the flour tortilla, stop here. If you're using the corn, however, adding either green pepper or jalapenos is an excellent idea since the corn combines well with higher levels of spice. I wouldn't suggest putting rice or beans in it, although my brother enjoys putting one or the other in his. Just don't take his example and put garlic in your burrito. That's gross and ruins the flavor of the egg. This style goes well with chocolate milk, home fries with cheese and butter, and a side of breakfast beans if you didn't put them in the burrito itself. Hope you guys really enjoyed this. I thought it was interesting. Jim Zhang, I hope you now know how to cook eggs properly because I know you were very concerned about this topic. And I will see you guys in the next video. Shadowlance out. Round start. <sighs>